Hey everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how to play Naomi 2 games on Flycast. Okay, so you're going to need Flycast. If you don't have it already, you can head over to the site that I'm going to link in the description below. It's uh, GitHub, it is the developer's uh, page. You don't want to download it from here. What you're going to want to do on Windows is get the binaries on the build page. You'll download your Windows version. You want to get the late, the one with the latest date here. And once you have that, you can just go ahead and launch it. Now, they owe me two games. How do you get them? Well, you have to search Demuel Naomi 2 ROM set. This is the fastest way to find the Naomi 2 games you'll need because people typically use Demuel to play the Naomi 2 games. Now that you can play them on Flycast, this will be the easiest way to find them. And uh, I would recommend something like this, though I can't show you here exactly where to go. You know, I can point you in a direction. Now that you have Flycast in your games, just enlarge this here. We're going to go into the settings. And this is basically a fresh Flycast here. So I'll show you a few quick things to do. And I don't have a too powerful of a GPU on the system. So I'm not going to upscale too heavy. Although that is one of the things I will show you that you can actually upscale the games. We're going to add our directory. It's on our desktop. There will be two ROMs. And you'll see them like this. I'm going to select the current directory and we'll switch the cable type to VGA for the better picture output. And we'll leave this as is just for now. I'm going to maximize this here. Let's go ahead and launch a game. I'm going to start with Virtual Striker 3. Okay, so here we have uh, Virtual Strikers 3 running on Flycast. This is the Naomi 2 ROM. And as you can see, it's just running just fine. However, not all ROMs are going to work. I'm going to go back to the main menu. We're going to exit. And I'm going to try to launch Revision B. And it says error. This game is not acceptable by the main board. You're going to run into this a few times with uh, a few games you may want to try to run. And one thing you may want to do is configure your buttons so that you can get into the the arcade service buttons. So I'm going to hit alt here, which is the one I have set up for it. And I'll just show you right away here. Go into settings, go to controls, and I'm on a keyboard for the moment. You want to go to arcade controls on this top right hand side. Scroll down and I have service and test this control and alt. So here, this is the test button and the service button is going to select like so. Here I'm in this menu because I wanted to turn off the network settings. So we'll go to game assignment and here I turned off everything that had to do with networks. So I turned off network, advertise connect, card one and card two, because with these on, you'll see messages on the bottom left and bottom right of the screen while playing this game. And certain games need the network connectivity. You can just disable it this way as well. It also affects the startup time of the game as well, because it'll try to make a connection that's not there. So for this, we'll hit exit. And then we'll go back to exit over here. And we'll exit again. Here is Virtual Fighter.
we'll take this opportunity right now to jump into the menu and show you the upscaling that we can do with this game. Go into video mode and I have a setup for DirectX 11. And all I'm simply going to do is kick it up to 3x. We're going to hit done and resume. And immediately you can see a visual difference. And there's still more things you can do here. You can experiment with widescreen, although it doesn't look so good. We can just go ahead and activate that. We'll hit done. Resume. It may look fine, but you're going to see certain assets cut off at the edge of the screens where things no normally load. And now, as far as the BIOS is concerned, when you get your ROMs, you will see that the Naomi 2 BIOS is in there. You can use this ROM within the location of the ROMs right here as so, or you can take it and put it in the data folder that's in the directory for Flycast. Either way, it works. And here are a few more other titles running on Naomi 2. Your TUSA. Next game is quarterfinals. Fantastic. If you found this helpful, give the video a like. It'll help other people find it on YouTube. Let me know in the comments if you need help with anything further. Subscribe if you want more. Thanks for watching.
and I'll catch you in the next one.